So I feel like I've got so many stories that have happened over the years, um, disasters, mishaps, all sorts of things that have happened on my job sites. I can remember one time uh, in 2015, I was building a house and we had approvals and all of the necessary things were in place to take down a neighbor's fence because we were building a zero boundary garage and so the neighbor's fence had to come down. I had even previously spoken to the neighbor and everything was fine. Um, but because it, uh, on the day that we actually went to demolish the fence and it was a large concrete structure so we had to have um, a demolition crew and I had Dean Brothers there, the infamous Dean Brothers there to do the demolition and um, on the day that we were demolishing the fence we had the massive big concrete saw there um, ready to rip out the fence and cut the fence down and the neighbour who I'm pretty sure was on drugs um, went berserk and came across to our site, jumped in front of the concrete saw, nearly lost his arm and pretty much for the next 60 minutes just threw a spaz attack um, and refused to let us rip down his fence which he previously had agreed to. Um, anyway, it got so out of hand that he actually called the cops and I called the owners and the owners came down um, from Brisbane, this was on the Gold Coast and it was a big ordeal. Many people were on site, there were probably about half a dozen cops there, lots of construction workers and um, in the end what ended up happening was even though the neighbour had called the cops, the cops actually ended up arresting him <laughs> for trespassing and carrying on as a public nuisance and um, so it was quite an ordeal and then I can remember he got um, thrown into the back of the cop car and the cops actually asked me um, to wait until they took off before we removed the fence and so I agreed. Um, I was paying the Dean Brothers by the hour, by the way, which was costing me a small fortune, so I was getting pretty anxious about how much it was costing. And then um, we were waiting for the cops to take off, but the cops had a flat tire. <laughs> so I waited another 15 minutes for them to fix it, but in the end I just said, I'm sorry, this is costing me too much money. And so in the end we ended up ripping the fence down with him, with his face pasted up against the back of the cop car window watching as we ripped his fence down. <laughs> so that was a memorable afternoon.